Hi guys, it's Lena, and I'm coming at you with a um, design team project for MB's Treasurista. And what I've created this month is an altered clothes pin. And this is the first one of these that I've ever made. And I'm super stoked and excited about the way it turned out. Um, it was originally a wooden color, and I painted it um, kind of like a vintage white color. And then I adhered some, I'll, I'll show you the back because it's just, the back is unbellished. So I adhered some, um, I think this is Kane Company um, Ancestry.com paper. Um, the paper didn't, wasn't, um, wasn't labeled, but um, I'm pretty sure that's the stack I saw it in. <laughs> um, so yeah, and I just Mod podge that on. Um, and what I did is... Um, I wanted a, um, well, it's for pictures first and foremost, so you open that up and you stick your picture in and you close it, and I wanted to have a bird cage and a bird on the front of it, um, but the bird cage, uh, die that I had was, um, pretty big, it's the Tim Holtz caged bird die, so I used it anyway, and really all I did was I took it and I, I cut my, um, bird cage in half. And then I kind of overlapped it and just made a smaller bird cage. So you can see that's where it overlaps. So I thought that was pretty clever. <laughs> um, and so what I did to embellish it is, um, first I distressed all the paper with um, walnut stain distressing. And I just wanted kind of like a grungy kind of a color, you know. Um, firstly I took some... Uh, cream drapery trim and that's down here and um, just affixed to the bottom and then I took some of this awesome white daisy pearl trim and I fixed that on top and I love that um, the bird here um, that's all colored and um, sprayed with um, like a shimmer spray so the top of it's more of a brownie color and then his tummy is more of a gold color. I'm not sure if the camera is going to pick up on that, but it, he's really shiny. And then for his feather, I just added um, a really cute white feather. And then I took some of the um, gold ruffled satin trim. And I just lined this one side with it. I'll show you the back side of it. So I lined that one side. And then to finish off the edge... I added the light blue pearl trim and this is in the 4 millimeter. Um, and it was just a really nice accent and the blue picked up the blue in the paper, picked up the blue in the bird cage. Um, so it, it worked really really well. Um, and then I used some of the snow white seam binding here and I just tied a quick little bow and I stuck that down um, with hot glue. And really just before I hot glued the bow down I stuck down the uh, cream wheat leaves which I love and I've just bent them so that you know gives them a bit of character and then stuck the bow down so um, really simple but I think really nice project um, this is all from MB's Treasurista and there is a sale um, going on and it's from the 16th to the 19th and it's the St. Patrick's Day sale so if you head over to um, the blog you'll read more about that but you also if you go to the the actual shop which is a zibit shop um you'll be able to save moolah and get all the supplies and that you you need and you like so missy's um great she's got great products so i would be sure to check that out um be sure to um check out the links all the links to everything that i've used will be in the description bar below and um, also there will be pictures following this video. So I thank you guys so much for watching and um, we'll touch you guys in the next video. So take care guys. Bye.